What is up YouTube and welcome back to another video. Today we are back out at Circuit of the Americas and we're going to be checking out Super Lab Battle Day 2. There is going to be drifting, there's going to be racing, and there's also going to be a car show. So y'all definitely want to stick around to the end, like, and subscribe, comment down below which one is your favorite car at this event, and let's get to it. So right now we are about to get another ride along with Kenny. Yesterday we got a ride along, but unfortunately it didn't go as planned as y'all basically saw from the last video. We got in a bit of an accident. So let's see if today we don't get in an accident and we freaking shred out there on the track because this man, he is one of the best drivers I know in all of Texas. He absolutely shreds. He always throws it in so hard. So hopefully we get some of that craziness today. And yeah, let's get to this driving. You ready for another fun ride along? So right now I'm basically walking down from turn one here at Coda and I'm gonna basically see if I can walk all the way over there to the S's where that flag is. I'm not really sure if y'all can see it way, way over there. There's a flag. I'm gonna see if I can walk all the way over there. I'm gonna see if I can stand right here for a little bit. I'm gonna get some shots of some cars coming down from turn one and see if I can capture the flag right behind it. And then after that, I'm gonna head towards those S's that I said and then I'm gonna get that iconic shot with the other flag whenever they're like just freaking swerving through the s's i've heard that shot is really really unique um yeah and i'm gonna see if i can go capture it right now and i'm gonna be posting it on my instagram so if y'all haven't already be sure that y'all check out my instagram because i'm gonna be posting a lot of reels on there and a lot of photos from this from this super lap battle event so be sure that y'all go check it out i'm gonna link that in the description down below so yeah be sure that y'all check that out and i'm gonna see if i can get a bit of footage for you guys as well right here all right, so in this spot that I was in right now, I got these photos right here. I'm gonna basically be putting them up right there on the screen so y'all could see them. Those are the photos that I got. Y'all can also go check them out a little closer on my Instagram. That's where I'm gonna have all of these posted up later on. And yeah, basically right now I'm gonna move a little farther on and see if I can still get a few shots of these guys on this session. If not, then I'm gonna have to wait until the next session. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Dude, that is so awesome to see. Focus because they have fences in my way, but yeah, right here we have a uh, Rafa's. I think it's the GT3. I don't know if it's the RS version, but. Ooh. Man, I feel like y'all can just hear it because y'all can't see it because it just like the fence blurs it all out, which kind of sucks. And then right here we have like I think it's a Pro Charge or 
turbo Corvette. Has it right on the side. It looks absolutely insane. A Garrett turbo sticking out the side. Insane. So this is the second session that is going on right now. And we have the 720 GT3X, I believe, in front. This thing has been absolutely shredding since yesterday. And then right behind that, we have two of the Gran Turismo looking cars. I don't know what kind of cars these actually are. If y'all do know, comment down below. But look at those things. They are ridiculous. Next year I really need to consider bringing a golf cart because holy crap, two days of walking, you get so damn tired, I swear. It's like a three and a half mile walk all around Coda and you usually don't have like an exit to just go out and like go to like the drifting or go towards like the car show. You literally have to do like a whole walk around if you don't find one of the gates open and that's really unfortunate because if you don't have a golf cart, it's going to take you a while. Man, look at that, 296. I want to see if we can see that bad ZL1 Camaro. That thing is so bad. I'm just waiting to hear that thing. What a Dundon Motorsports flat six sounds like. They are incredible. And this is a BMW M2, I think. I feel like the new style of them, I kind of dig them. A lot of people don't really like them, but I kind of like them. Those two right there might be one of the loudest ones on track right now. They that that Dundon Motorsports Porsche, it literally just hums like I could hear it humming right now like crazy. It's just I don't I don't know if I'd be able to drive something that loud. That that is a little bit too obnoxious for my level right there. I just want to jump in between this video and tell all of you guys that I am very thankful for y'all basically giving me all the views that y'all are giving me on all of the videos that I've been posting posting lately it looks like a lot of y'all have actually been enjoying the videos and yeah I'm gonna make sure that they keep coming out better with higher quality I mean right now I have a laptop that gets me limited for my quality because I got a whole lot better camera right now the Sony a7c2 and I just need it to be a little bit better so I'm gonna need to get another laptop so if y'all could just go down below and subscribe be sure that y'all are turning on post notifications and y'all like the videos so that y'all can help out the channel and that we can get out better videos for you guys all right so right right now it's basically lunch time and we're gonna go ahead to get something to eat there is a bunch of people that are basically in the pit areas checking out all the cars so hopefully there isn't too many people at the food truck so that I could at least get a bite to eat today because I am absolutely starving so let's cut to a little bit of clips from me eating right now and then let's jump back into the action of super lap battle 
So I know I said I was gonna show y'all the food for a little bit, but I didn't show y'all anything. I completely devoured all these nachos. They came with beef fajitas. They were loaded with a bunch of queso and then some beans, lettuce. It, they were absolutely amazing. Just trust me on that. They were delicious. But right now we're gonna get back to work and come film all the crazy cars at Super Lot Battle. Right here we have the record holder R35 GTR yesterday or this morning. I don't remember when. I, I saw a post about it, but I don't actually know when it went down. But this car put down the fastest lap here of like a minute and something, I believe, around the track, which is absolutely insane. This car is ridiculously fast. Last year he had a different wrap on it. This year it's like this white and like different color theme, but it still looks phenomenal, super wide super big arrow all around it's just an absurd car hopefully later on we can see it ripping around track again right now i am basically on the side of the big straightaway in front of the bleachers checking out some of these cars flying by and check this out the gt and the full carbon amg gt yeah but oh my lord it is ridiculous being out here watching all of these cars basically flying by. They, are, I'm pretty sure they're going above 100 miles an hour right here on this straightaway. It is absolutely absurd. Like, check this out. Man, they are so loud. I'm actually glad that I have ear protection. I got these Raycons right here. Raycon, please sponsor me if y'all can. <laughs> GT3X has been putting some crazy laps down today. 